Welcome back here on Live Now from Fox. And I do want to get back to this breaking news that we have been following out of Falls Township, Pennsylvania. This is a camera that is set up by our Fox 29 Philadelphia team as we follow the latest on a series of shootings that have led to the deaths of at least three people. And we know a suspect is still sought. We did get these photos that came in a short time ago from our Fox 29 affiliate there in Philadelphia. You can see the suspect that police are looking for. That is 26 year old Andre Gordon. Now I want to go over the details of what we know so far about this situation as authorities in Bucks County, Pennsylvania identified the suspect as a shelter in place order remains in effect there. Police say they are searching for 26 year old Andre Gordon, who was last seen driving a stolen vehicle. You could see it in some of those photos that we just showed you there on your screen. Police first responded to Viewpoint Lane in Falls Township just before 9 a.m. local time for a report of a shooting. Uh, they did, of course, later locate that vehicle that they were searching for. According to police, Gordon shot and killed two people at a home on that block and fled in a stolen vehicle then drove to Edgewood Lane around 9-ish and fatally shot a third person before fleeing the scene. Around 9.15 a.m., police say he carjacked a vehicle at gunpoint in the parking lot of a Dollar General that is over on Bristol Pike in Morrisville, if you are familiar with the area. The driver of that vehicle, we're told, was not harmed. Now, he was last seen operating a 2016 dark gray Honda CRV with a Pennsylvania plate reading KFR 1534. Police providing photos of the vehicle that you saw a short time ago and also of Gordon, who does remain at large here. He is on the left side of your screen and on the right side is actually a live image that is coming from one of those scenes in the area of the shooting. Now, shortly before noon, sources telling Fox 29 Steve Keeley that the carjacked Honda was located in Trenton, New Jersey, and that SWAT teams were responding to that scene. Falls Township Police have since confirmed the vehicle was located unoccupied in Trenton. We do have a post here on your screen coming in from Steve Keeley there at Fox 29 as he post that photo of the suspect and says breaking police in Trenton have just found the carjacked Honda CRV SWAT making entry into a house where it's been found. That is according to law enforcement sources back out here live to the right side of your screen a view of the scene. Now Keeley's also reporting that local authorities requested additional resources from several neighboring departments, including Pennsylvania and New Jersey State Police at this hour. The Bucks County St. Patrick's Day Parade canceled as a result of that shelter in place order and several local businesses in the area also closed temporarily. Governor Josh Shapiro noting that he was informed of the shooting and said on X that he was directing Pennsylvania State Police to work with local law enforcement and provide whatever support they might need. Congressman Brian Fitzpatrick, a Levittown native, taking to X or Twitter following that incident, which he referred to as an active shooter. He did say there is an active shooter alert in Falls Township. We are monitoring a carjacking and a shooting in two sections of Falls Township. I am in touch with law enforcement officials as they pursue the suspect. Now, at this point, we are waiting for any sort of news conference or anything of that nature. Once it does happen, we will bring it to you live, raw, and unfiltered right here on Live Now from Fox. I do want to head to a quick two-minute commercial break now at 1239 on the East Coast and 939 on the West Coast.